In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to create and upload a browser icon, also known as a favicon, something like this here that shows up in your browser when you have the tab open and also shows up in mobile Google search results. So to get to this point, I recommend using one of two tools. The first and easiest tool to use is favicon.io. It's 100% free and you can either take an image and turn it into the icon format. You can take text and turn it into it or an emoji. So if you have an image, then you can go through here and upload your image. Once you've uploaded your file, it'll convert it and you can download and then you will get a zip file and if you want to open up that zip and you can extract it then you'll actually get one for every size and you can just use this format here so I'm gonna go ahead and extract this to just my desktop and show the files there so there we are I did tell it to pull just that one out now in Squarespace what you'll do is you'll go into design and browser icon and this is in Squarespace 7.1 and beyond and you can go ahead and say edit image or in this case we'll just delete the image add a fav icon and just grab that there and there it is now it's uploading and saving and the reason that that is so grainy is because the image that I uploaded was a really small to begin with so I would start with a larger size first probably something around 800 pixels and that way you actually have it scaled down whereas I was starting with 300 pixels or less and so there's not a whole lot of give there so what you can do is you can either if you want to use a the generator you can use some text here and that way you just say S and you know you say that you want a circle and a font family you can search through Google fonts and see what you like all right I'm playing with this enough now uh, I'm just going to go ahead and select a color and then you can just download it there. You can also adjust the font size if you want to make it a little bit bigger. Really fill in the space there. And then go ahead and download that and then you can upload it the same exact way on Squarespace just in design and browser icon and then delete and upload. You can also use Canva for free and you, you go and create a design and you do custom 300 by 300. And in this case you can use an existing icon or an existing logo that you already use. So that's what I'm going to do in this case. So I'm going to find this here. then you go ahead and download that make sure you name it a good descriptive name say download PNG download and then upload that the exact same way on your Squarespace backend and there you have it and so now if I say save and if I refresh that to there then we'll see the new icon simple as that uh, it's a good way to customize your site to make it so that it stands out unique otherwise you have that square Squarespace box 
I uh, hope this was helpful. If you have any questions regarding the Squarespace, put them in the comments down below. Be sure to give it a thumbs up. And until next time, peace.